party. Stop rolling, I'm not ready yet. This journalist doesn't wake out of bed camera ready. I need five more minutes. Ugh, make it 10. No, I just came by to pay my debts. Your debts? <gasps> the George Clooney bet! That's right, look at me, I won 20 bucks. <laughs> Somewhere safe. Yep, I told you, I knew he was gonna get married. All right, so it took him 20 years, but when a guy really wants a woman, he is going to go for her and get hitched. <laughs> yep, I could have him. What attracts you to the Italian culture in that country? You. You see, I could have had him, but I didn't. Because, you know, I don't date guys in the biz. And besides, he might be the sexiest man alive, a great actor, producer, Oh, humanitarian, and he has great hair. But it's George Clooney. I mean, the press follows him around everywhere. Imagine dating him. Okay, he would be high maintenance. Hi, George. Melissa DeMarco, good to see How you, are you again. I am good. Fantastic. Oh, you're looking sharp. You're looking uh, sharp. It's not, I'm not comfortable. Okay, let me fix that for know, you. It's a mess. You know, you're looking like this is your a premiere schlubby. tonight. A little schlub. It's not good to be schlubby. Mm. Oh, no. I dodged that bullet. But I'm happy for George. I mean, he ended up with them all, right? I mean, she's a graduate from Oxford University, speaks multiple languages, a human rights lawyer, and she's a hot, leggy brunette. <laughs> now, he settled. And he could have had all this. <laughs>